Hello, welcome back to the Flail playthrough. We are here, and we are beautiful. Thank you. Thank you for asking. I am beautiful. Alright. We are back, though. And there's some stuff we need to accomplish. Why do I have a pitchfork in my inventory? You want a pitchfork, man? You want some, you want some nuts? I'll give you all of them. All on the house, alright? So, yeah, welcome back. We got some stuff that needs to get done. I added in a new mod here. Probably should favorite. Probably should sell a bunch of this stuff. Holy fuck! I had in a new mod in here, made by the person who's creating the spirit mod, and it's a yo-yo mod. Now there's only a couple yo-yos that we can make use of, like two of them. But even then, they're still really cool looking yo-yos, and they will hopefully have some nice dope features onto them. With them, on, onto them, with them. Added in with them. I don't know what I'm trying to say. Can I? Quick stack. Thank you. Thank you, you actually let me quick stack and I didn't keep on talking to whoever was like on top of it. But yeah, hopefully we can grab those. I don't know where to grab them. Is a harpoon considered a flail? I mean, it does range damage, so I'm not going to consider it a flail. Even though I'm pretty sure it's a flail. But we have a mod in here that's not making it a flail. So all kinds of conflicts going on right here. There you are, holy shit, it took you forever. Waiting for your ass this whole time. But we are obviously going to try and upgrade, like every episode, it's pretty much what we're primarily doing in this series. That's what you do in every Terraria series, but we focus a lot more on upgrading our equipment like every episode in this series. There's so many flails and yo-yos to get through, and I want to make sure we get through most of them. And we also got to upgrade our armor in this episode. I might grab the Harpy armor. This seems like the easiest armor to get. That or the Danger armor? But even the Danger armor is kind of hard to get. I'm gonna say kind of hard to get. It's just like you gotta kill somewhat uncommon monsters to get it, and I don't like that. I don't like somewhat uncommon. Which one's doing more damage? They literally do the same amount of damage because they are pretty much the same, just different in the ways you get them, which I kind of like. But I didn't like that I got both of them nearly the same time. But it's fine, it's fine. I'm still make use out of it. I really need to get an actual double jump. Because uh, I'm not going to be wearing this armor for too long. I guess we're going to get wings soon. So it shouldn't matter that much. That, at least that's our goal in this episode, is trying to get wings. But we will see. Alright, well, I'll just use a yo-yo. This says fight because uh easier to hold on to people. Or keep it on people, I should say. But boom! We are done with that fight. Nice and simple. Get the fuck out of here, you. No noise making when I hit you. But you only make noises when you're dead looking ass. Okay. There we go. Can I quick stack? No, I can't. Who the fuck hit me? What? Oh, there's an invisible person there. Did not notice. Get the hell. Get the hell. Get out of here. Invisible skeleton. That mod still hasn't updated to like nerf spawn rates. It's fine. It's fine. Let's buy Arcane Fabricator. Sell all the shit we don't need. We don't need that. Uh, what do you have? 53%. That's a very odd percentage. That's a very odd percentage. But I will sell this in exchange for the steel mallet. Now why not? Give me that blacksmith's apron, man. Let me rock this blacksmith's apron. Now I look pretty, pretty swagged out. Is that my... Never mind. My character's skin color is black. I thought I was wearing like black shirt underneath but that's just <laughs> I guess it's a black shirt underneath whatever let's not talk about that uh hold on really quick let me clear my inventory all right just looking at some recipes here probably should how do you make these oh, that's not that hard to make I'm trying to make armors that I never have used yet oh god thanks 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 asshole stop it have it wait have we had a, a meteor crash yet it's something I always forget in this in this series I have no clue. Uh, I do have this phantom armor. I originally was going to make the phantom set. But I not noticed that it's kind of OP this early on. So I'm not going to make it anymore. And that's fine. We'll figure out a fill in for it for now. But yeah, let's try and get this harpy set. I do need to get grab potions. So that's something we need to find. Do we have a meteor crash somewhere or not? I'm, not, I'm very confused here. I feel like there is. Look, we went under there. The question is, if we have a meteor crash, which way would it be? Right? Let's try right. And really quickly. Can I quick stack? Oh, you can't quick stack because it's in my fucking hotbar. I hate that feature. 
Um, can you guys like exterminate down here? You ever heard of that? Extermination? I'll do it myself. Little fucking cubes. Little cubes that spawn too much. Little underground fireball monster. You get out of here. Alright, he wasn't underground. No, well, he's kinda underground. Do I have a grappling hook? I do. Alright, let's head to the right, see if we can find some stuff, because I really need to get a grab potion and I really need some meteor stuff to be get a better pickaxe. Okay, so <laughs> I died in a rally dropped. That's tremendous. Um I killed a what was it? Crawfish? Craw crawd crawfish? I think it's a crawfish crawdad? I don't know, but I got danger shards. I was I'm about to record a clip be like, hey, I got danger shards. Maybe I'll make the danger armor set. Let's see what really quickly what the danger armor set does. Because I have no clue. 8% increased melee. Alright. I'm not making that. <laughs> it doesn't help. Even though none of the armors I've made so far doesn't don't really help. I don't I don't need it. It's 5% increased movement speed. I think low-key we should make the steel toed boots for the future. While running, your your regen your life regeneration is increased. Um, your dash will will reach its peak faster. But <coughs> sorry, uh, steel toe boost, five percent increase move speed, falling speed is moderate. All right, I'm just gonna get these. All right, I don't care. I don't care what you say. Let's uh, what should we replace though? Let's question this. I didn't. I don't feel the falling speed. It's moderately faster. Holy shit, wait, I'm carrying so much gold with me. Alright, time out, time out. Apparently when I quickly deposited items, I had a bunch. And when I say a bunch, I mean a bunch of danger shards. Alright, 21. That's almost a bunch. Look at this. Look, looking this. Look at this. I can actually make some stuff here. Not the whole set, though. I, I'm not I'm not gonna make the whole set because I don't want to lose my double jump. We're back to get the rally. I don't know if it does any more damage than what I have already, but it's still a yo-yo I wanted and I didn't think I would get throughout this playthrough. Alright, see this. This is unacceptable. <laughs> this is unacceptable damage. I expected a lot more than just 14 damage. It's fine. Look, it has troubles killing piranhas and it's stuck in the it's stuck in the floor. Hey, we got actual Hermes boots. That will help. That will help a whole lot right here. And they're warding? That's gonna be useful. High key, that's gonna be useful. I will not wear them for now. Maybe like, you're fucking crazy. Thank you. I'll take that as a compliment. Hey, that's gonna be useful too. Look at this. Sharpening station. We do melee damage though. That definitely will help. Is there anything else here? What was I? I was about to say something. Oh, I'm kind of gathering up. Low key, I'm not only just looking for grab potions throughout chests. Low key, I'm trying to gather up, you know, some stuff for a yo yo coming up. But yeah, like I said, I'm trying to get a use. I don't know if I officially said it throughout the series, but I've definitely been replying to comments and saying it. But I want to get a use out of most of the yo yos and flails during certain times. At least want to fight a boss with, like, the bigger. Not the bigger, but. Ones that I feel like, like, hey, you know, this one I got, it took me a while to get this. I need to fight a boss with it or something. It doesn't have to be the, uh, a new boss or anything. What the fuck? Did that just happen? All right, well, that just happened. I accepted, apparently. It was my stupidity. My bad. I clicked on the garbage can and apparently used a fucking potion. All right. My bad. What was I saying? I don't remember what I was saying. Why are explosives not worth any money? What? will be worth money when that special thing comes up that I'm gonna do with them. Huh, what? Alright, so, yeah. Definitely wanna use yo-yos on certain bosses. Not certain bosses, but at least on a boss that I feel like would be on par with the difficulty, or on par with the, like, journey we took to get the yo-yo. Something like that. We'll figure it out. We'll figure out when the time comes. And, uh, speak about coming. Look at all those geysers everywhere. Now, at this point, you're like, Gamer, there, stop fucking cutting the video every one second. Sorry. This is the flail playthrough. I feel like this playthrough is different when it comes to progression. When it comes... When it, when it, when it comes... to about coming. No, uh... I feel like the progression is, like, way different compared to the other series. The mage series. The mage series, we are just, like, straight up moving forward, moving forward. 
this series, we're not exactly moving forward, you know, progression-wise, but we are moving forward when it comes to, you know, items and stuff. That's pretty much what the major playthrough is, too. But we are moving extremely fast forward in the major playthrough. And especially since it's a mage playthrough on non-expert, it's like 10 times faster. And I'm glad that I did it on non-expert, because not only am I happy about not dying every 5 seconds, but, you know, we're allowed to play with the prefix mod in peace. We're allowed to play with the Legend of Terraria mod in peace. Maybe once Legend of Terraria gets, like, nerfed, which shouldn't be not too far from the future, but whenever that gets, like, nerfed, a lot of the enemies and shit get nerfed. I'll definitely, you know, start playing in expert mode more often. Because there's just some, just some fun with expert mode. I'm not trying to spoil anything, but in the way future, there's definitely... Well, this kind of is a spoiler either way. Definitely in the way future, I will be doing another throwing playthrough. Because throwing is just so fun, and then there's all the stuff that I didn't get to do in the beginning of the throwing playthrough. A lot of stuff that I missed out in the beginning. Uh, because Thorium wasn't out when we originally started the series. And our go-to throwing mod was... Uh, Throwing priority, which is no longer just gone, it hasn't updated since the last time I used it. Oh, here's a meteor. I can actually mine it. I did not feel like I could. All right, time to get dirty. I got one bomb. There you go. I'm gonna die doing this. Hold up. Can we get some meteor enemies this month? I get like, I can get harvest meteors off of certain meteor enemies. Look, it's a pimple. Holy shit. You got you got jobs you got jobs hops I was about to say but you know I wanted to say jobs for some reason you got jobs man okay let's just slowly but surely gather all this up why am I gathering this shit up again I don't remember hey this guy drops meteor he didn't drop it there the uh, meteor slime drops meteor would you expect that low key I felt like the meteor heads one time in Terraria. I don't remember when, but I feel like I remember them dropping their meteors when you killed them. Am I crazy? Is that a, was that never a thing? I feel like it was. I think I might be crazy. Maybe that was in one of my modded series and I had a mod that did that. How many modded series do I have now? Four? And there's another one coming up that I'm not talking much about? If you follow me on Twitter, I did post a picture about it. You know, it'll, it'll be fun. It'll be interesting. Oh, chill with the UFO. So we can reach you. Some guy mentioned that I gotta make sure I have the yo-yo string against the twins. Of course I'm gonna have the yo-yo string. Why would I not? How are you gonna do yo-yo playthrough slash flail? Don't forget the flails. How are you gonna do the yo-yo playthrough slash flail playthrough and not have the yo-yo string? Huh? Who would do that? Who would do that, huh? Crazy people. I'll probably forget. I'll, I'll forget something. Alright, we found the meteor though. That's exactly what we wanted, but you know what else we wanted? I forgot what else did we want? Gravi gravitation? Yeah, that's what we want. Gravitation potion. We can make one. But we kind of need harpy feathers and... <sighs> It'd be easier. I mean, I can just build up. But it would be way easier to get, you know, a gravitational potion, find a sky island, and also fight harpies. Like, we'll get more done doing it that way. So that's why I'm looking for that, for it to be done that way instead of, you know, just building up. Because I have to build up and that sounds hard. And I like exploring, it's way easier. Yeah, these flail playthroughs, hopefully they'll be longer episodes. I want these episodes for this series to be longer. Because there's a lot of stuff we gotta get done in each episode. And uh, really quickly, let's pop open the, uh... Can you not? The fucking living hemorrhage? I was looking up the gravitation... Uh, recipe. Hold up, this is a bad idea. I was gonna pop up the new yo-yo mod we just installed. But I'm pretty sure the recipes, there's no recipes for any of them but the, like, little basic yo-yos. It only adds in a handful of yo-yos that are, like, craftable. Why does this dude hurt? Alright, let's do it by mod. Yo-yo overload. Yeah, these are the only ones that are craftable. Pearl wood does some decent damage, but we can't really get pearl wood. So, uh, there's no really point. But, ah, uh, fuck. I guess the only way we can look at it is if we do it this way. Yo-Yo Overload. This is the one we want to get next. The Fireball. We might have to go get that, like, really soon. Because that, that, that's really low damage. And we already have a godly one that does 21. But that does 21 base damage. So that might be something that we gotta go grab by the end of this episode or something. I don't want to go down here. I don't even want to risk going down there. I'll walk around. Wait, is there spikes? I could really spikes. 
there's no spikes. I don't expect Skeletron to be that hard, so we'll fight him. We'll fight him soon. Fucking old hag looking ass. Let's see what kind of ocean goods we can find. Hello, undead warrior. Nice to see you're out here for a fucking swim. Apparently. Anything? Yes, there is. I will take it. I will take this and bye bye. Don't know who's shooting at me. They're not even on the screen, but okay. Thanks for shooting at me, I guess. I appreciate it. You know, he's trying to make me stronger in life, a stronger person. Thank you. I respect you because of it. Not really, though. I remember why I wanted Meteorite. I remember. Can you believe that? Oh my gosh. Oh shit, we can make a Meteorite yo yo. <laughs> Forgot about that. Uh, we can make a Meteorite yo yo. That's one thing. And also, we can make the fuck. <laughs> What's it called? We can make a meteorite drill, which drills from a uh, tremor really OP. They're really good. They last you a really long time. The early game drills, that is. And I don't usually grab them in some places. I think the throwing one, I grabbed it and it, you know, carried me through a lot. A lot of the early game, that is. But yeah, we can make one here. I will make it out of amethyst. Might as well. It's forceful, too. What's this shit, huh? You ever been force fed before? I haven't. Why did I say force fed? What? You have been force fed a drill before? That shit hurts. I haven't, but I'm just asking. Let's go ahead and while we're at it, make this meteorite yo yo. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> Weak? Forceful? I'll take forceful. I will take forceful. Question is, does this ignite people? See, you'd expect it to ignite people. But it doesn't. You know what that means? It's useless to me. Sadly, it's useless to me. I might have to, I have to get rid of it, pretty much. It's fine. No, we'll keep all our yo-yos. We want to display our yo-yos. Yo-yos. Okay, I'll admit to bitching out here. Because Oh, shit, look. <laughs> what the? What are the odds? All right, never mind. I won't admit to bitching out because I found one. I knew I would. I knew I would, guys. I told you. I told you. Look at that. <laughs> what are the fucking odds? I was about to say, like, no, I'm just going to build a... There's a platform up here, farm some harpies, but this works too. I will accept this. What did I get? Lucky horseshoe. Pretty nice. I will get rid of these chairs. I don't want anyone moving in up here. I hate when that shit happens. Especially if it's like a really important, uh, what's it called? NPC? That's, that, that sucks dick when it's a really important NPC. Can I put those on auto trash so I don't ever use them again on accident? Where do you put the horseshoe? Yeah, where do you put the horseshoe? What? I don't, I don't see where. I don't know. Am I crazy? I think I'm crazy. All right, harpies, come on. We need to farm a lot of you. I did get rid of the other flail, and I'm letting uh my third, the meteorite yo-yo, have some, have some beautiful shine time. And then after we get this harpy armor. What the fuck was that? I just saw something fly across my face. Uh, we'll go grab the yo-yo from the the uh, yo-yo overload mod. So hopefully these harpies uh, won't take ten years to spawn. Hello, harpies? How do you? What's a harpy call? What what noise does a harpy make? Ah! The harpy call has worked. The 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 ah! Whatever noise I made. <laughs> I'm very sorry for that noise if it uh, scared you. I don't know how much shit we need for this. So I guess I'll just get a good abundant amount because we are making the armor set and then an accessory from it. Is there? No, I don't think there is yo-yos from it. I think there's only like a spear and a bow and then possibly uh, what the fuck is that called? Boomerang? I don't know what the harpy shit is called. Prothorium. I have no clue. Hold up. Do I have ropes? No, I don't have ropes. Alright, then we'll just drop down. Whee! Great drop! Good job, Game Raiders. I knew the floor was coming, but, you know, I didn't pull out my grappling hook fast enough. What is the shit from... What is it called? Flight? It's called Flight, isn't it? It's the Flight set. Yeah. Alright, I was right. I was right on my first try. Look at that. Psych. Allows minor flight, slow fall. That's exactly what we want. Where is the armor fabricator? This... No, oh, was it arcane fabricator? Not armor fabricator. What? Flight wings on deck. Infinium on deck. That's all I can make. 
Fuck, dude. That's like nothing. All right, hold up. Recipes, what are the recipes? We just need more feathers. Holy shit. That's a lot of feathers I have to gather, guys. I don't know about that. I don't know about that. All right, I do know about it. We're gonna go get these feathers, all right? Ooh, quick flight wings. Flight wings. Flight wings. There you go. You can, you can, you can speak. You can speak Gimmick. Speak like a human. Fighting. Holy shit. All right, so what do we, we need like a million feathers. And look at these, look at these drop rates. Look at these feather drop rates. It's amazing. <gasps> There's one. Yes. That's one. We only need, uh, <laughs> that's, that's two. We need like, like 20. Probably like 20. More than likely is 20. For some reason, I had a feeling that their drops would fall through the platform. I don't know why. I was just like, man, I gotta pick up their stuff after I kill them because they'll fall through the platform. It doesn't work that way. But I'm getting a lot more spawn rates moving out to the right. Maybe I was too close to the NPCs. But I went out to the right, built this platform. Spawn rate's like 10 times faster. Thank God. We hit the 10 mark. I should be getting a banner anytime now. But we hit the 10 mark. Banner. No, see, that would have been a nice on cue right there if I got a banner. People have been telling me, though, you can place uh, banners on platforms if you hammer them. And I thought I accidentally placed one on a platform, but I guess I accidentally hammered that platform. And I placed one on it, and then in the future I try to place one on, I try to place a banner on the platform. I'm like, what the fuck? This ain't working. And it's nice to be notified that you gotta hammer it. So thank you for that information, even though that was like a long ass time ago. From whenever you're gonna see this episode, hopefully not that far. Maybe I'll be on vacation by the time you see this episode. I don't know. But I have so much shit I need to get done before vacation. Like I said, I don't know when you're going to see this episode, but whenever you do, it's like seven days, seven or six days before I go on vacation. I need to upload for a whole month. Schedule upload for a whole month. Three videos a week. That's what I'm aiming for. And I'll try and make it like every other day you get a video. Uh oh. But at least three times a week. I was going to do two, but I feel like two would be like not enough. Uh, not enough for you guys. Just, just wanna, just wanna get you guys a good bunch of stuff. I don't know what series though is gonna be the thing. I don't know if it's gonna be Terraria or what. If it's gonna be Terraria, I have to start working on my uh, series that I have coming up. Very special idea I have coming up where I make up my own rules for this specific series. There's a lot of harpies here. Yeah, I'll make up my own rules for that series so no one can be like, this is this fishing playthrough is wrong. You didn't follow the rules, even though I was like one of the first. Hey, we got a herpy banner. Even though I was like one of the first one to record and put up a fishing playthrough, and I originally I got the idea because I heard the um, fuck when was that? I heard the the Terraria developers, Red Digit and uh, Senex Senex. How do you? I don't know how to pronounce your name, but uh, her and him, him and her. You know, I saw on Twitter Senex she posted. Like, me and my husband, Red Digit, aka okay, Red Digit. I don't know if she said me and my husband, by the way. But, she's she put on Twitter, like, we're doing a uh, fishing-only playthrough. Wish us luck. Something like that. And then I read that. I was like, hey, why don't I do a fishing-only playthrough? And that's where the idea originally hit me. And I didn't really see any other fishing playthroughs on YouTube. And also, a goal in that fishing playthrough was to use, like, weapons I never used before. Items that have never been used before. For example, the obsidian armor. You know? And people are like, you're doing shit wrong. This is not how you do the fishing playthrough. You're supposed to only use fishing items. But I I started it. So I did what I wanted. Enough ranting here. If I wanted to rant, I would. Make our own video for it. Make my whole, whole own video. New series, guys. Game Raiders Rants. No one would watch it. How the fuck is there... How close was I to the desert? Not close at all. Why was there an ant lion here? Didn't they fix that problem with ant lion spawning? Like, hey, ant lions won't spawn now. Blah blah blah. They won't spawn on little patches of desert. I remember that in the patch notes specifically. But how come that one just spawned like straight up out of nowhere? Hold up, guys! I need to make my armor. Stop! I need to make my armor. All right. Oh shit! We got this thing modded. That's okay. Oh shit! Don't worry guys, I got you. Got you with the help. Look at it, you like the help? Look, you aggroed onto me. Alright, let's make this armor. If we can. I don't I'm not 100 if we have enough. Do we? 
Fuck! I thought we had enough. Alright guys, I'll be right back. I gotta go back up. I gotta go back up there. Hey, don't touch me. Don't touch me. He's touching me. I'm trying to quick stack. Alright. Yeah, I'll be right back. No, I really wish there was uh, an early game way in vanilla Terraria to manipulate time. Because shit gets annoying sometimes. And the only way in mods I think we can manipulate time is early mode. Or not early mode. Uh, Pre-hard mode. And even then, you need like a good couple of things to manipulate, manipulate time. So, I don't know. Sometimes like fighting through blood moons can be annoying. Especially like during that one moment. I don't know. Was it the throwing playthrough? The throwing playthrough, I had like a hundred blood moons. It's like one after another. Like every night. That shit was the worst. Expert blood moon. Expert any event is just terrible. It's a disaster. Meteorite has landed. Why did the lighting change just to say that? Anybody notice the lighting like changed when that happened? Hold up. Can I switch to the Stig? Let's switch to the Stig. Young Stigmata. Let's see what let's see what we can get done with a young Stigmata. You know, my health is lower. Was it the more damage? So I do more damage now? Ooh, I do 26. That's pretty good. That's pretty fucking good. I think we should have enough for the pants. We just need pants now. Now, cool thing. Well, I'll talk about the cool. Did that really go under there? Really? Come on. Now you're going to go under there? All right. We don't have a chef, do we? I don't think we have a chef. Oh, God. Hello. You guys are going to kill me. Please don't. Please don't. I missed, I missed the fucking flail hit on the two. Alright, whatever, it's fine. It's fine, let's just go down there, let's craft the rest of the armor, but... What was I about to say? Do we have a chef? Because I want to see if we can buy the corn. I don't think we have a chef, though. We do not have a chef. Fuck. Of course we don't have a chef. Haven't we had, like, multiple blood moons? I think I did a blood moon off camera. Yeah, that's what I did. Pretty sure, unless I did show it, I don't know. Hold up, let's get that one feather that landed way over here. I'm slow as fuck. Oh my god. Uh, what can I... I don't know what, is, what I can put on. Oh, there it is. I can put on my steel toe boots. Again. I don't care. Whatever. It's fine. It's fine. Let's head over here, though. And let's make the rest of this arcane armor. Pants on deck. No longer pantsless. Alright, let's read the armor set. Wing time is increased by 15%. That's the coolest thing about this armor set. It, like, really helps out the wings that you get. Or that you want to get. Uh, 10% increased movement speed. Uh, you suffer no fall damage. Oh, well, you never suffer fall damage if you got wings, anyways. And increased jump height. Well, <laughs> jump height's not gonna matter when you got wings. Like, I can never notice jump height when I have wings. Holy shit. I'm coming in. I'm coming in. I'm here to save you. It was all me. You gotta stop shooting. It's all me. All me. Can I put on these night vision goggles that are ass? Fucking golem party. Look, they're killing my boys. All these golems. Fuck off. No. They killed Ludo and they killed the guy. I'm just gonna refer to him as Ludo, not the painter. Because what's the painter ever done for me? I mean, he drops a pretty nice paintball gun. But other than that, I don't fucking care about him. Never cared about the painter. Why can't I pick that up? I'm supposed to auto trash that stuff anyway, so I don't know why I didn't pick it up. I don't want that sword, whatever it was. You now this auto trash ability is really good. And I didn't understand it at first. I thought it was like auto trash everything you uh, encounter, but it auto trashes uh, certain items, which is really cool. Fuck. Hold up. <laughs> I need to auto trash some stuff there. Uh, You know, I can sell some stuff too while I'm at it. Hello, Paul. Do you want... You want avian cartilage? You know, I kind of have like a million of them, so... It's only right if I, you know, shared the wealth with everyone. Not really the wealth, share the goodies with everyone. How about that? Here, you also get to have some of this stuff. Rock steel leggings? I know you like leggings, man. You're freaking those. <laughs> Alright, I got one final goal before we end this episode off. I don't know how long it's been. Feels like a long time for me, but all the cutting I've been doing shouldn't have been uh, that long for you guys. I don't know. It depends. It depends how much cutting I did and didn't do. But we're going to go back down to hell, and we're going to try and farm this yo-yo from the yo-yo overload mode. I had to think of the name for a second there, but yeah, that's what we're going to try to do. And that's what we're going to do. All right. Oh, shit. I have a piece of gold in my inventory. Who cares? We got our first runner up right here. Stop it. We got our first runner up. Come on, kill him. Don't let him teleport. Alright, it's a rare drop from imps. That guy's an imp, if I am correct. 
pretty sure he's in him. Hold on, I want to kill this guy. I want to kill the voodoo, die, voodoo guy, but... Oh, shit. He came up here. Made my life easier. I was going to have to come down there and try and grab it. There's no lava down here. It wouldn't have mattered. Ooh, get up here. All right. But yeah, that's what we are waiting for. Waiting for young imps to come in. And we're going to destroy their lives. I'm very sorry that I had a phrase it like that. Please don't fucking kill me. I'm too, I'm too, uh, I'm too beautiful. Look at this. You want to see me? I'm too beautiful. You can't, you can't even see me. I wonder where that, where'd he go? Oh shit, there he is. I wonder where that yo-yo is going to hit multiple people really easily. Is that just me? Like, if like two people are like hugging each other, two enemies are hugging each other, you can hit multiple people. I find that weird. Just something I didn't feel like the yo-yo would do. I feel like yo-yo is like a single target item. Single target, target, uh, weapon. There you go. But it's pretty dope. I don't know if you guys know what I mean when I say single target. I don't know. Just, there was two enemies hugging each other off camera. And I hit both of them at once. And almost like insta-kill both of them at once. I'm not trying to brag, but I can insta-kill sometimes. I don't know what the drop rate is on this, but it seems kind of ass. Because I've killed at least like eight of them. Eight or nine of them. I picked this up. It's pretty good. It's pretty fucking good. I'm not going to lie there. Hold up here. So I do 20. And it's not really worth it. <laughs> Rather, you know, keep what I got on right now. Because uh, it's working. Holy shit. Huh. Got an obsidian rose. That's what it's called? Yeah, obsidian rose. I got one of those before I got one of those yo-yos. Alright. I'm going uh, to look up the uh, forum page really quickly. Make sure that it's from fire imps it's from fire imps right i don't know but i'm gonna go check really quickly and see if i can find a drop rate number i don't know okay it has been 25 minutes later let me wait 25 minutes like who the fuck i have killed 50 imps two obsidian roses on deck it said it's an uncommon drop so i don't think it will take that much longer hopefully it won't. please don't take that much longer hey what the fuck what the fuck is here? Oh, it was a bat. Hey, we got it! And we got a plumber's hat? What? Is that a vanilla thing? I don't remember that. We got it! Look at- holy shit, this thing's fast. What the heck? That's really quick, I like it. Alright, so apparently this thing shoots fireballs. Oh shit, it does shoot fireballs. Very interesting. Very, very interesting. Alright, let's try it out here on these guys. Holy fuck, I like this. I like this a lot. This is a major upgrade here. This is a major upgrade. Definitely the the one, the Amazon, that's what it's called. That's going to be an upgrade, too, whenever we grab that. But look at this. This might be uh, brain-worthy here. We have Crimson, right? Yeah, I'm, this might be brain-worthy here. I think I'm going to use this against the brain. Probably. I don't know many other yo-yos I can really grab right now. I'm not fighting Skeletron. I can't really grab the one yo-yo from there. But we did it. Hello. Bye bye. All right, let's go. Let us go to the surface. One thing about the uh, what's that flail you get from the shadow shadow chest? That flail, I feel like I'll grab that after the anchor flail. Cause my goal is to grab that anchor flail and make a use out of it. it. It never gets used, and I wanna I wanna be not the first to use it, but I wanna be definitely one of the first to use it in a flail playthrough. Pretty sure I haven't seen anyone use it in a flail playthrough. In the one flail playthrough that I've seen. I don't really watch many other Terraria playthroughs. I watch my own when I edit. Does that, does that count? But yeah, I'm going to end this episode off here. Amethyst token on deck. Thank you. You gave me the same thing again. And I will see you guys in the next episode where we will... Should I keep this? What is it? Wait, hold up. Yeah, I'll keep it. Where we will give each other beautiful, yummy head.